All right, welcome back to another video, you guys. I know y'all been waiting for this for a while. And I know I keep saying that I'm gonna drop another video and I haven't in a while. I know, I know, I know. Take it easy on me, okay? A girl has got a lot going on, all right? I was just getting ready right now, doing my makeup. And I was like, you know what? Right now would be the perfect time for me to slide in a video start talking to you guys because there's been a lot of stuff that i've been wanting to talk to you guys about you know like a lot of updates a lot of changes in my life as you guys can see i'm in a different place as my last video so i know a lot of you guys are here to watch this video right now because a lot of you guys are some no i mean that with full respect shoot i could be nosy too sometimes you know like when there's some cheese man and my friends or my sister call me and they're like hey i'll be right there like yeah but anyway we're gonna get into the video um i don't really know what i'm going to talk to you guys about i think i'm just gonna go like start talking and then i'm just gonna go from there you know like this video like the video subscribe hit hit that subscribe button hit that bell button too so that way you could be notified every time i drop a new video and hopefully the next one is pretty soon um hopefully do not hold me to it because a girl has a lot going on very busy you know um but yeah um i'm gonna get into it i'm gonna update you guys on a lot of stuff that i that has happened in my life um I'm gonna share some of my plans with you guys. Um, I'm not gonna say too much just because um, I've noticed when I do spill the beans on my next moves, um, somehow people find out. Well, obviously, because I post them. If you know, you know. We're just gonna leave it at that, okay? You guys see I'm in a different place. Yes, your girl and her man got an apartment because i think my last video was a makeup video and i think i was at my mom's house life is great you know what i mean that's one update another update um is i have to be super real with you guys i'm not sure if i want to keep cutting hair there's just a lot of stuff that has been going on and i have a lot of reasons to back it up why i'm just not into it like i used to be like a lot of you guys know from my instagram that me and my man have been cutting hair together we literally sit right next to each other so we're with each other all day every day every single day you know we got the same days off like we literally have the same schedule we're with each other 24 7 so yeah we're together all the time um but it's, that doesn't bother me though like I don't get tired of being around him he don't get tired of being around me if anything we love it like it keeps us together it makes us stronger like I don't have to worry about him it like I'm right there all the time like I know everything and he knows everything as well you know so there's no secrets some people they can't they say that they can't work with their partner because for one they say that they get tired of being around them you know you're at work all day with your partner you go home and you're still together like you still see their face like you might get pissed off about it or whatever but i don't like i feel like i don't know if i've gotten used to it and we've always been in the same career field but that has nothing to do with how i've been feeling about cutting here anymore um i feel like i have been pushing away from like you know cosmetology and doing women's hair and like you know people ask me all the time like do you do women's hair and i'm just like no i don't like if you guys know like my hair is hella long you know like it goes down to my waist and let me tell you i've gotten trims before at salons that i have been recommended to that they were good <clears throat> good places to go to and guess what i tried them out i went to go get a trim and when i say a trim i mean like maybe like that much max you know like that's all i need like that's enough to have split ends you know so i know how pissed i would get if a girl cut too much of the length um that i asked you know obviously i wouldn't start a fight over that or anything obviously i would just leave i would still pay because the girl did her job you know she did what she did 
she still did the work so i would still pay her but i would not return you know i would not return so because of that i know how complicated it complicated it is our hair um some of you guys hair grows faster than others mine doesn't grow back that fast um my hair grew fast when i was pregnant with my daughter and other than that it hasn't been growing anymore so yeah i don't like to getting trims at certain places like arguments with girls are just like way more um intense than like arguments with guys like you know so it's just a it's totally different like working with guys and working with girls um so i feel like that's why i've pushed away towards it and i've just been dealing with cutting men's hair lately but i feel like lately there's something inside of me that just wants to like switch it up so again if you guys have been following my instagram for a while you guys have you guys know that um i have been posting a lot that i've been wanting to do lashes i want to get into doing lashes i'm going to start doing lashes blah blah <coughs> lashes 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 right so i started um looking into it since last year actually i started looking into it i started watching videos my lash tech at the time um she was really good and she actually told me that she wasn't certified but she she got down on my lashes you know like she did the damn thing so me being like okay she's not certified and she gets down like this she has all these clients and she's not certified so that was telling me like okay why do i need to be certified you know so for the longest um i started watching youtube videos uh tiktok videos on eyelash extensions um lash tech videos like everywhere you could possibly think of i was on pinterest looking at lash mapping um everything looking at all the supplies they use what type of supplies what type of um glues what type of lashes all that different stuff right so i was watching hella videos and i bought all the supplies i bought the fans the glues um the lashes uh i got a mannequin um i got what else the spoolies like i got almost everything tweezers as well everything i got it all okay except i didn't get the primer that's the only thing that i didn't get was the primer but besides that i had already bought the the basic supplies right so i bought the supplies i was going to start lashing i actually lashed my cousin's um i did my cousin's eyelashes and i have that um picture posted on my instagram so if you do want to go see it you know go follow me um i'll be dropping down in the description my personal instagram page and also my eyelash page so you guys can follow both check them both out uh let me know what you think but yeah so i did my cousin's lashes they came out pretty decent but they weren't the best that was my very 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 first time doing lashes so obviously they weren't gonna come out perfect i was actually very impressed they were really good like she wanted kind of like a strip look kind of like this but kind of fuller and that's what i kind of gave her she was happy i was happy you know like i was like okay like this could be a thing i could start you know doing girls lashes but i wasn't really offering it i didn't make a lash page until recently that being because i didn't make a lash page right away because i was still unsure about it i was still unsure only because i didn't bless you i didn't believe in myself so a lot of people around me tend to doubt me a lot um i don't know if it's intentional or if that's just the way they are but i like to hear like you got this um keep going you're doing great you know like motivational saying like if i come to someone and i'm like hey blah, 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 i'm gonna start doing lashes what do you think like you know if they're not like all happy about it and they're not like oh i'm happy for you and instead they're like oh i don't think that's gonna work oh i don't that's not a career you know and i i let that bring me down and so for the longest i wasn't going into it i wanted to but you know i wasn't really pushing it that was really kind of holding me back like i had a lot of doubt in it and then and then i started seeing girls around me and this was maybe more than four girls around me friends that i know or acquaintances that i know they were actually jumping on the lash trend but i'm i'm not mad about it you know i congratulated every one of them i was super happy for them like you go girl like you're gonna do 
Like, you know, that's the kind of encouragement I want. Careful. That's the type of encouragement I want, you know? So, like, I want that type of encouragement for me. So, that's the type of encouragement I'm going to give to other girls around me, you know? So, yeah, I wasn't mad about it that they jumped on the last trend. That's just my fault for doubting myself and not jumping on it when I when I was going to, when I wanted to, you know? So, um, being that I've seen all this, I was like, okay, these girls are getting certified. I wasn't going to get certified because the lash tech that did my lashes wasn't certified. So, I was like, you know, why do I got to be? But then, you know, suing and if you do something to the eyes, blah, blah, blah. Like, that shit could be really serious, you know? And so, it made me really think, like, you know, that's true. Um, so, I was like, well, yeah, maybe I should get certified. So, I was looking into classes, and I came across one. And I, obviously, if you know me, I'm, an, I'm a very impatient person, um, especially when it comes to stuff that I'm super excited about. And I was very excited about this, as you guys know, since the end of last year. Um... I was wanting to do this so can you imagine waiting so long and you see girls around you or just people around you in general that are actually jumping on the trend that you are trying to jump on like it's not really a trend it's just like it's a career but there's bomb ass money in it okay so that's why I was trying to jump on it but I didn't let anybody stop me I was like you know what I'm gonna take this class I paid for the class I went to the class your girl got certified yeah so your girl got certified and so now I am a certified lash artist. Yeah, I recently made my Instagram page. Um, I was like, okay, I'm gonna get certified. Let me start making my Instagram now that it's serious, you know, because before obviously I was doubting it and all that. Um, it was so hard to come up with a lash name, a business name, but um, after a couple of days of thinking, I finally came up with a good name and I came up with she lashed me so that's the name i came up with and that's what it is and that's what it's gonna stay to be i'm not gonna tell you guys much though i have a lot in store for what's coming in the future and i am not holding back no more i'm not doubting myself you know i'm gonna just go through with it i'm gonna just go through with it if i have a feeling like i want to do something i'm gonna do it and i don't care what anybody around me says because using this as an example this has been something that i personally have been wanting to do and i doubted myself because i listened to people around me and i've learned like you can't do that you know like it really impacts the way that you feel about um the situation and what you're going to do um so yeah um stay tuned for that i'm not currently i'm not fully done with cutting hair i'm still gonna be cutting hair i'm not sure how that's gonna work um but we'll have to figure that out um but i'm not done cutting hair either okay yo girl is two times certified lash artist and barber okay more to come okay i just feel like you know when you when you're sitting back and you're not doing much and you're focused on what everybody else is doing around you that like everybody else is just growing and growing and growing and they're leaving you down here because you're not working you're not watering your grass you're watching everybody else water their own grass and yours is turning brown you know so you gotta you know i've learned that you gotta stay watering your own grass and you gotta just go and go and go and there's gonna be other people that are gonna be down at the bottom and they're gonna be with their grass brown and they're gonna be watching you grow your grass you know, you want to be the one growing the grass, watering the grass. You don't want to be the one watching the others water their grass. Like, honey, come on now. You're better than that. But yeah, that's, um, that's mainly what I wanted to talk to you guys about. So, okay. so with no further ado, stay tuned to the pranks. I want to do some pranks on my mans. We are going to start some prank wars. Don't tell him. Um, shh. Okay. Don't tell him. But drop in the comments what type of pranks you guys want me to see. Or you guys want to see what type of pranks you want me to do on him. Or pranks on my daughter or on my family or whatever. Um, but yeah, drop those down below because they are coming, okay? 
all right you guys so i'm out of here this is the end of the video i hope you guys liked it i hope you guys enjoyed it um stay tuned for more videos and make sure you guys follow my instagram page down below in the description box um and yeah i hope you guys like the video and make sure you guys like and subscribe peace